This is Chikakori community, growing in the neighborhood of the popular Kubra area of Abuja, the nation's capital. Despite the growth, it has only one access path leading in and out. The provision of train services rooted through same community, although a plus to its development, residents have had to contend with the blessings that has also brought sorrow to many families. This is owing to the absence of crossbars or signs usually erected at every community, hosting train tracks to guard against accidents. Train ramming on people in this community, residents describe as one too many. The latest being that of Thursday, 15 December 2022. Solimota Ido Suleiman, like any other day, was set to go to work and with no premonition of a last conversation. A husband and the children bid her farewell. Few minutes after, danger struck as an ill-fitted Abuja-bound train rammed into her car held back on the track. She left and I was joking with her. You are going to work, bring some tea for me. It's not the first time that we have even sometimes the train will be moving without adequate information of it on. We are losing our people, we are losing our loved ones. Any magnetic material that comes around an unmagnet, un unmagnetized object can get it magnetized by induction. That is induced magnetism. And uh, since magnetism is, uh, is this, this magnet, with that magnetism, it, it intrudes a kind of force. There's a magnetic field around it. And this is a region of, uh, of influence or the attraction. Friends, colleagues, close associates and family members have been mourning the departure of Selim Mota Ido Suleiman. This seat beside me here used to be late Suleim Mota Ido's seat and um, unfortunately we lost her to a train accident here in Abuja. I will be speaking shortly with her colleagues to know what memories of her they hold. Bosse and Ibrahim of the Cleaning and Security Unit of NTA5 Abuja shared their last encounter with the deceased. Past it, she gave you, she did put a call across to you. Yes. As at what time precisely? Around 8.22. One that you ask, I just you enter Ibrahim, are you eating? I say no. Meet me in my office. Believe me, everybody knows, say, ah, that woman is quiet. For the head of the department of the finance unit and others, one phrase kept resonating from their lips, and that is the calm, unassuming personality Salimota Ito Suleiman was. The year has ended on a bad note in finance of NTH Channel 5. I will greatly miss her. The Director General of NTA, Salihu Abdul Hamid Dembos, led his management team to a condolence visit to the family. Thanks to Almighty Allah for the life she has lived and of course the lives that she has impacted. However, the community leader used the medium to appeal to the Federal Ministries of Works, Transport and the Nigerian Railway Corporation to provide crossbars in the area. Since the commencement of the commercial activities of the railway, Salimota's accident is said to be about the seventh sad incident on that spot and still without proactive measures. Personally, to the letter to Minister of Transport, his office, so both Minister of Transport and the state. Uh, uh, Minister for State. So we appealed to them. We even went as a as a group. I appealed to them that they should know how to help us for this community. The late Salimota Ido Suleiman joined the services of the Nigerian Television Authority in 2017 with first appointment in Adoikiti, from where she was redeployed to NTA 5 Abuja. Aged 47, the deceased left behind her husband and four children. She has since been buried according to Islamic injunctions. In Abuja, Serafina Okun Umekwe, NTA News.